Hey guys, welcome to Tuning In. So I'm Mike, I'm gonna do a lot of crazy experiment about the speakers, car audios, car electronics, and all that stuff. Before I start with the speakers, we're hitting already 10,000 subscribers. On my previous video, I say it's as soon as I hit the 10,000 subscribers, I'm gonna start to making the giveaways. We're hitting, I'm so excited. Thank you very much for watching and subscribing and commenting to my um, the videos. I love to read the comments, I love to answer and uh, here we are. I'm reading every single comments. You guys was asking the dead death bounce. You guys asking on Ryan. You guys asking DS18. You guys asking uh, Eminence. So you guys asking all the speakers in my on my table right now. So we have these speakers. Before I go to speakers, I gonna I, I want to start to give away. Uh, just in case so I need the more speakers is coming more reviews is going and more guys getting the nice speakers right if if I hit this video of 50,000 views um, I'm gonna give away Arnold's pair these speakers are sold sold by uh, each individual uh, the, this one's a pair this one is a single and the PRV is a sing single unit but when you win you're gonna get two speakers not one so uh, how we're gonna do it all these giveaways i'm gonna upload i'm gonna record the video before and i'm gonna announce it not who win not who's gonna win as soon as i upload it you have to watch the video together with me i'll be in the live chat answering all the questions talking with you guys as soon as you guys be in the live chat watching it any place on the middle any place on the, the start i'm gonna send something so you have to reply me all that stuff it's gonna be like interesting crazy stuff as soon as i put the notes before i upload the video i'm gonna record it who's gonna win and by your steps by your movement by your watching you're gonna win one of these speakers and i'm gonna, I'm gonna tell them which one is is playing this video which one playing the previous which one playing the next video as soon as i hit the 10,000 subscribers you guys you guys gonna be happy i want to build the community like a huge community you guys watching supporting my channel and definitely i want to give you back something like legit not the showing like all oh, iphone boxes all the bs bullshit i'm gonna put the requirement every single uh, item i give it to you you have to make a video after installation and send to me so it's gonna be on my channel said uh, from now every, every single videos i'm gonna upload uh is saturday after 8 p.m uh, one day before i'm gonna uh, send notification you guys gonna uh, find notification after 8 p.m you have to watch with me to win the channel like uh, i upload the video you guys watching together like uh, last time it was around 100 people were watching it on the live chat we were was chatting it but i like that idea so now every single video i upload it so one speaker it's gonna go away because uh, by that time i i'm gonna have 10,000 subscribers but I'm always like a 9,000 subscribers right now so in three, uh, how much the, in, in two months we hit the, like a 5,000 subscribers so thank you guys for watching let's do with the speaker review uh, I have a uh, today's uh, death bounce two speakers one the Niadi magnets reason why it's the video it's kept a little longer because I was waiting these guys these guys was a back order so as soon as I get uh, they get in stock they ship to me so now I have a two Arnolds from the Death Bounce. Um, Sylvester's is coming also, so we're gonna we're gonna see the Sylvester's very soon. So we, we're gonna do the videos about the each speakers, uh, similar price range. The was some of them it's gonna be like a double price, some of them it's gonna be less. But the power output is gonna be totally uh, totally different. So for the same price you can get the double power handling or you know half double handling but it's a quality speaker so we're gonna find out today um, i have a prvs a lot of guys was asking the prv niagara magnets because good it was good in the internet so these guys making the very good speakers i was unboxing and looking with the bemas um, i do have a bema also here so when I want to check the BIMO with the PRV, the build quality is the same, just for the half price. But sound output we're going to test really soon, right? So um, I have a BNC, so let's start from the BNC. BNC, it was my favorite speaker, it's going to be $220 per pair, right? If this is the 8 ohm speaker, but still with the 8 ohm, this speaker was a killing the Pioneer Pro series and the many many speakers like uh, the sound outputs from these speakers even the 8 ohm it's really good speaker 
for, for the price. If you wanna spend like $220 per pair, I think this is a very good speaker for to, to get. It's an audio magnet, it has a horn and it has some special uh, rings inside, so it's gonna keep cool. It's gonna keep cool your cones, and as you can see, you see moving is very hard, stiff. You can move the cone, but it's when you give in the bass, they, this was a, like a crazy jumpy speaker, right? And a very good sound quality. And the plus, uh, these are papers, uh, sandwich is thick, strong paper, so it's like a built tough quality, right? Um, it doesn't make the producer too much bass because the mid range speaker, so we crazy we're gonna do the crazy experience here so we're gonna give them like always you know tons of bass so next i have a ds18 ds18 package is also ds18 this comes with the, the nice the package but it's like a regular cheap box with the nice stickers um they, they also hit you up with the, the nice ds18 speaker okay th this is the D, um, this ds18 is gonna cost you around 180 dollars per pair uh, 250 watts rms 500 watts maximum power this is the 8 ohm and the build quality for 100 $180 speaker is not bad comparing the you know the other speakers around so uh, I have a more expensive one uh, DS18 is coming it's it was in the back order I'm still waiting but uh, maybe we're gonna run them with the Sylvester's right and th this company is the design wise build quality it's, everything is nice but it's uh, even the connectors you see it's hard spring con uh, spring load connectors and the paper quality it's also like a sandwich paper but like a stiff, nice, uh, the paper, the cone, right? So we have a DS18 here, comes with the nice, the, the box, and on the box you have all the, you know, the features of the, of the speaker. So now we have uh, three Ryans. Uh, this is the cheapest Ryan. It's gonna be $90 per two speaker, right? $90 only, $45 each, Nadu magnet, uh, they, uh, projecting like 250 watts RMS from this speaker, but we're gonna run that. We're gonna give him even more. We're gonna give him a lot of bass because this monster brother, 400 watt RMS, it was a destroying a lot of uh, a lot of speakers from my previous video. If you're new to my channel, definitely subscribe to, to my channel, and you're gonna see a lot of you know crazy experiments. We're running these speakers like a subwoofers, and we're you know, running like a tweeters. We're running like a mid mid range speakers. This is very good price for uh, for the pair of speaker, and also it's like a fifty dollars speaker. You're not gonna see any spring loaded connectors. This is like just the factory replacement. You just take it off the factory speakers, just connect the, uh, the wires, screws it in, and voila, you, you get right away the best sounding speaker in your box. Even the Ryan, it says in the Ryan box is good. Uh, on the box you see you have all the informations and it says the best performance when powered by Ryan amplifier <laughs> that's good so the Ryan's the packaging is good uh, all the information you have cutting dimensions you have in the box and you have those couple stickers also from the Ryan so uh, that's the Ryan I have another Ryan this is a little bit expensive this is $140 per pair also it comes with the nice uh, the box like all the Ryan's it comes with the nice box nice packaging and the horrible horrible pictures on the internet when you're buying the speakers on the internet you you're watching the you know the photos the best photos best pre presentation and the so far the best customer service death bounce I'm not getting nothing they, they don't have any affiliate programs anything like that if I sell these speakers a lot I don't get nothing so uh, but I'm, I'm telling you like, the truth every time I email each company um, the dev bounce it was at the always first and always ready to answer your questions and I was uh, you know maybe it's a new company like a small company but maybe it's like a giants but still the like, customer service is good so you can lay on right now is like lay on on the, the customer service whatever they are uh, performing right now right so now the, the back to Ryan Ryan it was a this giant is a killer now is re replacing not replacing the, the, this one's a 300 watts RMS power so this is HCCA uh, the model everybody was asking to get, get at this and this one is a uh, the bigger replacement for this one with the bigger magnets like they advertise like 1800 watts 
maximum power with a two inch voice coil. This guy is also like a two, oh shit, this is heavy, man. <laughs> this one, so you see the voice coil. Only two speakers has a two inch voice coil with the Eminence too. So, Ryan is a build quality is good. Only thing I notice right now, um, when you see the cone and you know around the surround the cone, it's moved a little bit to the one side, so it's not the perfect center like uh, DS18. Even the DS18 also like um, you know it's a little bit one to move one side because it's open. You can see it um, if they close it like these guys. You never see what's going on inside. So. Uh, the only thing we're gonna run this in the higher output so we'll see it's gonna be it's gonna be an issue or not but it's not touching to the cone so everything's fine stiff uh, the cone moves uh, spiders also is like a hot um, also connectors is very nice as I say like a DS18 and the wires it's uh, stitch it to the spider like a subwoofer does but th these speakers doesn't need that to do that but it's Hey, uh, they, they want to do it, they do it, and it's, he will have it. And you can see the extra glue on the cone comparing with the DS18. So they say, you know, just get it here. You know, it's like the run this speaker, we put the extra glue, we put the extra effort. So you're gonna, you're gonna be happy to launch it. How's it called? Launch it very off the speaker. The build quality is good, gas, gas is good, price is right. For the ride this guy is going up now it's just sold out everywhere <laughs> after my after my video it's also it was with the jbl gto all the speakers are sold out and they did they, this selling again now and then let's let's start with the eminence this speaker is like more than 50 years in the market and they still building a lot of people likes this speaker uh two inch voice coil yeah they advertise 175 watt rms power I think this guy is gonna. This guy can handle the 200 watts RMS, like 200, 200 watts, no problem. Has the build quality, right? It's like a very tough build quality. Um, regular connectors. This guy is gonna cost you 200, uh, $130 per pair, and this is the right, right price for the the magnets, like uh, ferrite magnet speakers, right? And the connectors also is a regular connector. Just you connect with the. Uh, regular connectors, no spring loaded, anything like that. You don't see any extra glues sticking out. Um, interesting stuff. This cap on the uh, around it's you have a hole, and on the back also it has a hole. It means it's gonna get a lot of air to the cone, so the cone is gonna be like a heat sink. Um, it's gonna cone is gonna work a lot colder, and you can run them a lot higher volume like these guys the prvs also you see in the engine magnets all these uh the speakers has a hole in the back and eminence 130 bucks for the two speakers we will run them and we'll see the sound quality for the price when you're getting arnold's guys was crazy on my every every other every other comment it was uh, when you guys when you're gonna get the death bounds when you're gonna get the death bounds because we are where are the people? Me, the person, I don't like to see reviews from the dealers the who's selling it, who's trying to sell it. That's why I'm comparing these speakers to we, which it does. I'm not the dealer. I'm not. I, f I feel it with the, any any of these companies, right? That nobody is sponsoring me so far, so I can tell the truth. That's why you guys like this kind of uh, reviews, except you know, couple haters. So uh, Dev Bounce. Uh, I, I was impressed with the customer service first, but we will see. Uh, things I don't, okay, things I like it. The magnet is giant, like a uh, same guy with the uh, eminence. Uh, this guy now it's on sale. Uh, click the the link or just go to Dev Bounce USA, and they have a the promotion is going on. Very very soon they're gonna take it off, like 15 or 20 percent promotions. Uh, after I review it, if you like it, just go there and you know purchase your speaker because you guys was asking a lot. Uh, the build quality, the basket is coated like a bed liner on the on the F-150 trucks, right? The spring bed liner is like a very tough uh, paint, and you have a little foam on the back, so when you install it, you're not gonna feel any kind of vibrations, all that stuff. 
also comes on this guy, Eminence, um, like a foam, but, but it's not foam, it's like a, uh, like a rubber, but when you install it, it's gonna be a lot, sitting very tough. <laughs> guys fighting with each other so uh, the connectors is good you're gonna do the Y connectors it comes with the Y connector so you just install and screw the tie it down it's gonna stay forever and the wires also to the cone it's uh, stitch it and glue it to the spider so you can see very very good build quality but it's the uh, right amount of glue, not the extra glue like a Ryan's does. Ryan's always put the extra glues. You see, you're never gonna get the problem between spider and the cone. <laughs> so, the paper, this paper quality, when you touch it's little thin, that's, I don't like it. Maybe it's designed to produce a lot better sound, more details, more frequency. But when you touch it, these guys, like for example, it has a thick, you know, the sandwich of paper, all these Ryan's. Yeah, the Ryan and these guys is exactly the same paper design. This one's a little, little thicker, but this guy's very thin. And these Ryan's also, you no, know, DS is a thick paper, so uh, these guys, the paper is thin. But it's a one inch voice coil. Uh, well, one and a half inch voice call so we're gonna run this guy very soon as uh, a lot of good reviews but we're gonna find out it is good Pr uh, price was a well, uh, 199 for two two pairs right it's gonna be same price with these guys almost the same price these uh, the ds18 the close price but uh, the magnet ma the magnet this Ryan the giant is cheaper than uh, Arnold but we will see. These guys are $250. Niagara magnet, same design. Uh, paper quality is apocalypse. I like this. Apocalypse is new. This is, was a back order. Uh, this is a brand new model and heaviest model in the Niagara magnets range. And th this guy has a 300 watt RMS. And uh, all the Arnolds is plays a lot higher uh, frequency response, so 200 and plus. Uh, but so we're gonna give them a lot lower, so we'll see how they will produce sound when it's, when it's a lot lower frequency, right? Yeah, we're gonna give them a, a lot higher, so we're gonna see how's, how it will play in the higher uh, hertz. Uh, the build quality, the design, and presentation is the best. For example, when you're buying the speaker, uh, go check how Ryan presents their product right it's a horrible pictures everything is like um, not so clean and when, when you see the pictures I, you, you don't want to buy it like it's some like a garbage stuff uh, pictures with the Ryan sign on it from, from the top who, who cares about you know watermark right you, you, you put the watermark on top it's better put the, the better picture these guys has a 3d like effect CGI kind of pictures so when you, you when you just watch the pictures you want to buy that product that's what they do doing it they, you're not gonna get the actually picture of the speakers from the camera this is like a full, uh, computer generated but it's really nice you know when you when you look at you you want to buy that product uh, you have a paper sticker here and the no holes for the voice coil and the connector is also like a Allen key connectors uh, and yeah is a very, very for, for, for the thick thick wires is it's good it's 250 dollars for the niagara for the two pieces so we comparing almost the same price we have <sighs> okay so I, I have a prv prv design is to, total different when you see the niagara magnets the, this guy has a 250 watt rms this is the 8 ohm by the shape you can see it and this is a 4 ohm but the, both exactly the same materials just the ohm is different and the connector design is a little different same price $220 per pair and a lot thicker you know the, the wires not stitched to the spider and this is very stiff uh, speaker also uh, the build quality is well built you have a you know a cooler hole on the back and that's it. The, the basket is 
I think is the aluminum basket. Basket. The aluminum basket is the same thing for a 4 ohm, but the, this one has uh, the, a lot better connectors, like a spring roller connectors, like a DS and Ryan does. Is this the same connector? Yeah. <laughs> With the Ryan and the PRV, it's. This is the same, no, it's not the same magnet because the magnet is different, the basket is different. But the uh, spring load connector is exactly the same. Ryan has a plus minus sign. Uh, this guy has a, just uh, the painted, that's it. Uh, that doesn't have any, any, any sign. It. So Ryan is a cheaper for the same price, but exactly the same output 250, uh, 300 watts RMS. Uh, and the fragrance response on the Ryan is a lot higher, like uh, it's, it plays a lot higher than uh, the Pioneer. Uh, Brazil, guys, you, do, you guys doing a very good job with the speakers. Everybody, new, new company, I like that. I like everything new. I hate the you know, old and not manufactured, not updating the people. Like old people, like they didn't want to update their stuff. For example, you can ask why these some speakers are cheaper than other ones who has like 50, 80 years old on the market. No, because they're using the new technology, they, they're using the new, younger guys. They move faster, they think faster, they build faster, they update faster. They using the different technologies, different machines to build, to build a speaker. They are faster, quicker, that's why you can get the new speakers for a lot cheaper value. And depending where they were they built. For example, these guys are built in China. They have plants, they the most of them. These guys, uh, I think is in the Brazil, uh, the Mexico, Brazil, but uh, in China it's all, always is cheaper. Now, we have a Bema. A lot of guys was asking, where is the Bema? Where is the Bema? Bema. This, this is uh, just in case. This is a PRV at a 6M or 500 NDY4. Imagine magnets of the PRVs. Uh, this is the Arnold. This is the DS18 uh, Neo series, and this is the Bema. Bema PRO6WND. Made in Spain. Salute for the Spain guys. Also, it's exactly the same hole. The magnet the same, just a different paint. This one is like a chrome paint. This one is. Uh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Made in Spain, made in Spain. PRV. This, the both is exactly the same thing. Just the mesh inside is a different. But this is soft mesh inside. This is a steel mesh inside. You see, I'm, I'm sticking my finger to the hole to find out what is inside. Steel. The basket, exactly same design, same company made for them. Magnet is exactly the same. All right. Magnet is exactly the same. Or oh, okay. This place. The paper almost the same, but I, I think this one is a little bit better quality. Beam a little bit better quality, little that that much better quality. Now as a Bema guys, you can trash my channel. No, it's like a hundred times better. Actually, it's not hundred times. Uh, this is a little bit better. You, you, you know, it's like around surround exactly the same. Uh, this one's a little bit. Uh, the Bema is a little bit. Uh, softer the spider but the PRV is a lot harder and both the same outputs uh, on the Bema you have between magnets like a little bit uh, rubbers on the PRV you don't have nothing so but other than that the both is look look at this this is 8 this is 8 ohm right it's it's both the same for the double price this is $230 per speaker, Bema. And I have a PRV for $110 per speaker. So of course we're gonna compare with these two speakers <laughs> and we'll see who, who's gonna win, right? Double price should be double sound outputs. It's better, everything's double. Yeah, and this Bema, it's used a lot of glue between cone the PRV it's about about the right amount uh, only the Ryan's they use a lot of glues between spider and 
uh, cone. Connectors exactly the same, same company, same location. So on the Bema, you have a, a lot thinner, thinnest wire in these old speakers. Yeah, these guys are a lot thicker. Uh, it doesn't stitch it to the spider and it's a lot thinner than any other speakers in here. Even this tiny guy has a thicker wire than uh, the Bema use. But this is the, the most expensive one. A little bit spider is different. Maybe the cone materials inside is different. So the pretty much, if you guys didn't subscribe to my channel, definitely subscribe it. You're gonna see a lot of crazy experiment when we're running with these speakers with each other. So, uh, me like a customer, I don't care if you're using what kind of materials, you know, maybe you, you're painting with the gold on the back, uh, you, you're creating some design. For me, it's like a product and sound quality, that's it. If I spend that much money for a per speaker, and if I don't get uh, that's the sound quality, which is the half price guys offering the better sound quality, that's the way to go, right? That's why I'm uh, comparing for you guys before you spending your hard cash, 